Hey everyone, it's Paul Bertarelli reporting from the AUVSI show in Dallas. And in case you don't know your alphabets, AUVSI is the Association of Unmanned Vehicle Systems International. And they're holding their annual convention here in Dallas. And behind me, if that looks like a bridge, well, it is a bridge. And Intel built it here to demonstrate a new drone that it's marketing called the Falcon 8 Plus drone. It's intended specifically for inspecting all kinds of infrastructure, bridge, towers, whatever. And it was demonstrated here at the opening session of the AUVSI. And we got a little detail on how this system works. Intel's Falcon 8 Plus drone is an octocopter design with a unique trapezoidal airframe. It was developed by Intel's German-based drone division and is currently selling in North America. As you can see from these video clips, it's a cut above consumer-grade drones, both in payload capability and control sophistication. Like most drones in this class, it has replaceable lithium-ion batteries that give it a maximum endurance of about 26 minutes. With eight motors, the Falcon 8 has enough lifting power to fly a high-res camera mounted in the nose, and Intel says the Falcon 8 has a triple redundant GPS-aided autopilot that allows it to operate as either a remotely piloted vehicle or autonomously, but only within line of sight. The on-line of sight comes along later. At AUVSI this week in Dallas, Intel brought in its own bridge. Looks like stone, but it's actually plastic. Plastic or not, the Falcon ran a quick inspection to the delight of the crowd. The drone is designed to build a detailed photo mosaic with detail down to millimeter accuracy. But the secret is really in the software, which is capable of analyzing hundreds of panels of imagery to detect problems in whatever structure is being inspected. That might be anything from a bridge to a radio tower to an offshore oil platform. The system sells in the $30,000 to $40,000 range. For more, see intel.com slash drones.